one thing we've been doing for many years now um, and are unique to us are our supply chain tenders. The best way of describing what a supply chain tender is, is to take you back to the way that people typically buy in big organisations or big corporations. You tend to find they buy in silos. So you will have one group, if you imagine the supply chain being from here to here, individuals within that buy in their own silos. So you might have the transportation buyers and the raw material buyers and the packaging buyers all coming together to actually make the whole supply chain. Until a few years back, I think it was 2007 when we did our first supply chain tender, people couldn't actually either get their minds around or have the computing power to resolve a whole supply chain. There have been lots of people doing network modeling, which is fine and it's a good discipline, but in reality that's about static data. Our supply chain tenders actually let the market show the manufacturer or retailer, whoever we're working for, what they can seriously and realistically achieve. So if you can break those barriers between the silos and you can get the people who buy within those silos to collaborate and work together, as is happening now, you end up in a situation where you may put your raw materials and your packaging and your distribution onto the market in the same time. And remember, raw materials, packaging, conversion goes into distribution for getting your goods to your clients. So you can even tender the conversion process because a lot of people outsource that as well. But imagine the situation now. You actually have all of the components that make up your supply chain on the market at this moment in time. You put them out to market and you optimise the result. You get surprises, you discover new paths, you discover new suppliers, you discover new ways of actually doing the same business. Because at the end of the day, you have a demand that you need to fulfil. If you don't have a demand, there's no need to fulfil it. That's what supply chain does. And TESS as a product and as a platform is capable of handling the millions of data elements in a very, very constructive, very slick, very effective way and presenting the information back to the supply chain managers inside that business. And then they can actually act on that, grab the savings and redesign their supply chain being shown by the market because you really genuinely never know what you don't know until you go out to the market and you ask it to show you. And once they've shown you, you can optimise it, make your decisions and make the best decision to satisfy your client.